Go on bon Y, everyone. Let's uh, continue. There's a staircase in the wall in the wall head. Thank you for the information. Go ahead and beat up you, because we need we pretty much have to hide everything, not only for practice, but also just simply because we need the materials. Also, it looks like I have not healed up. I probably should go and do that. Alright. It's been a little while since I've done this. Seven. Nah, nah. Uh, do, 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 do. Four. Yo. See that a left or right? I don't remember which. Left. Got it. Alright. Now the question is, is what is uh the other two? It's not Shikara. Spirit in mind. Iki. No. Ow. We might lose some people because <laughs> I don't remember these. Yeah, this is going to get ugly pretty quick. All right. It's not text writing, it's not book. Life birth. Rest day. Let's try life birth. Hey. Nope. Yeah, we don't have. Uh... I might have to escape, which is fine. Uh, rest day off. Yes. Okay, I got one of them. And then there's that one. I don't think it's stand rise. I don't really have anything else to go off of. Deets. Definitely. Well. Inside, it's not inside the middle, it's not right, left, below, or up. It's definitely not any of the numbers. At least not the base numbers. It's not any of the things up here. Except maybe year. Don't think it's thousand. Let's try hundred. Yep. Nope. Oh no. Oh no. Village. There it is. Yeah, that's a. Oh, and you can't gain experience when you are not alive. Good to know. All right, let's go get healed up. The doors are already open, so it should just be a run in and run out. Okay, that gets us all healed up. Uh, how are we looking on kanji orbs? Lots of water, lots of fire, some gold, some wood. We have no stone. So maybe... We're actually close to getting enough for wheat. But you need stone for to convert to that, so that's not helpful. I don't think I have enough to convert over to rice. So that is for jewel, which takes water. So I could make 10 jewels, but that's not enough. Okay. Good to know. Oh, 
And apparently I have a bunch of uh, side quest stuff to do. Uh, I have enough gold. Do I have enough wood? I think I do. Uh, yes, I do. Okay, we can try upgrading. I can either upgrade the dormitory or this. Let's do, uh, let's do dor uh, dormitory first. Jen is here. Maybe you can save me from my boredom. Let's go shopping. Or, well, maybe we can't do that. But let's hang out anyway. Sure. Guess I'm going to do side quest. Um, you didn't tell anyone about my money situation, did you? I'd really appreciate it if you kept it, kept it quiet. Between friends, yeah? To tell you the truth, I'm not used to having uh not used to having so much money. It's kinda new to me. And all I wanted was a, a Japan getaway to blow some cash. I suppose I, I should fill you in, huh? Things were tough for me back in India. We didn't have much money growing up. Food was always the, the most important expense. I didn't have a dime to spare for for my own personal interest. When I finished school, I, I had a, a lot of spare time. I picked up a part-time job, but I still found myself bored every day. I wasted night after night scrolling through the internet, looking at clothes and stuff I could never afford. I started ha saving pictures of, of things for my dream list. Things I could never buy. Shoes, dresses, makeup, DVDs, books. On a whim, I started up a blog to share this dream list. A few of my friends followed it and shared. Before I knew it, I had 100 followers. People online that I'd never met were sh sharing my dream list. For some reason, it was becoming popular. And, well, within a few weeks, my my amount of followers went way up. I hit 1,000, then 2,000, then 2, 10,000. I put some apps on the, on the log as an idea to make some money. People could look at the dream list, and if they wanted to buy something on it, they could click the ads to purchase. Before I knew it, money from the ads started rolling into my bank account. I couldn't believe it. My first paycheck was for $10, the next week at 50 Week after week, more and more money came in from my blog. Um, after six months of running this blog, I had nearly a million followers, and my week weekly income was insane, more than anyone I knew. For once in my life, I could afford to buy stuff on my dream list. You have no idea how, how happy it made me. I wanted to make the most of it. I decided to come to Japan, one way or the other, and have the greatest shopping adventure of my life. So, yeah, here we are. That's me in a nutshell. Your bond with Priya has grown strong. Yay, more stats. Fuchsia Surge. Cures all allies' souls. Uh, cure all, all allies' soul and cures al ailments. Or increases all allies' soul and cures ailments. Okay. So let's make our dorms better. Yes, upgrade our houses. Upgrade complete. I don't know what this actually did. I mean, it looks pretty much the same. And it looks like we still can't enter a room. Hi, Chen. How has your day been so far? I know you think of me as your boring teacher, but even I need to relax sometimes. Do you want to grab a bite to eat? Sure. I have to say, I'm surprised you wanted to spend time with me again. After last time, when I was so was so uncertain, I wanted to say that things have gotten a bit better. I've come to terms with what's going on. I know, I know that you're all relying on me, so I'm going to keep doing my best. Anyway, did I ever tell you that I always wanted to be an artist? I kind kind of fell into teaching by accident. When I was studying at college, I'd spend so much time drawing pictures on my textbooks instead of completing my work. 
Does it surprise you to know that I used to slack off in class? You never would have guessed it now that I'm your teacher, right? I drew pictures and daydreamed about becoming a famous art manga artist. I wanted to become someone who, that could create wonderfully illustrated stories and share them with the world. But after a while, my college life became too busy. I stopped having time to draw, and I had to knuckle down and study hard to keep up with the other students. After a lot of work, my grades began to pick up. Some of my teachers noticed how much I had improved. Eventually, I got to the top of my class, but I hadn't picked up a sketch pad in over a year. My dreams of becoming a manga artist were truly over. When I graduated with the highest score, I was encouraged to pursue teaching. I didn't know what else to do. I simply went along with it. I took some more courses, years but went by. Here we are. Looking back, I do regret giving up my dream. Then again, if I hadn't taken up teaching, uh, if I didn't take up teaching, I would never have met you. I guess I'm torn about where I ended up in life. I'm here, I'm here now. But what did I sacrifice to get here? Yay, more stats and Azura dance. So yeah, you can see the affection levels. Uh, skills. So now we have Azura Dance. Increases all ally speed and restores them HP. That's not too terrible. Alright, with all that said and done, let's go back to uh, what we're doing. Actually, I'm going to re-enter real quick and then step out. That's just to make sure I max out my HP after getting the stat increases. Anyway, I need the refresher, so I'm going to keep fighting. Alright, I know that one is uh, below down. Nice evasion. Alright. It's not Power Strike. Spirit Mind Air? Okay. Nope. I guess... What was that one? Life Birth? Sure. Thank you. Okay, at least just that one. I honestly don't remember which one I went with. It's definitely not Stand Rise. Cute. Yep, definitely not those. Alright. It's not text writing, it's not book, it's not village section, it's not inside middle, it's not right, left, above, or down. 100? There you go. Okay. So, life birth. Curse, whatever that does. Uh, let's go ahead and get seven out of the way. Uh, five. Go. Below down. And then I believe that one is. It's not seven. I think it's eight. Hachi. Nope. Getting it mixed up with something here. Actually, it could be it could be writing. Fumi. Yeah, it is. It's just that font is off. Alright, um, I have no idea what curse is. Oh yeah, I didn't even loot the chest earlier. Also, I don't know what that was, but it's because it scrolled too quickly, but I'm assuming it was just materials. 
What do you got for me? First aid kits? Okay. On our first first aid kits. It is. A uh, collection of useful uh, medical items restores 50 HP to all allies. Very useful. It looks like we've explored all of the temple. It sure is weird seeing a place like this in Japan. Yeah, it's like it came from a different country. Or a different world. Surely that's not possible. Well, I wouldn't think so. But the kanji monsters we're fighting surely aren't from this world. The boy is somewhat correct. The kanji monsters are not of this world. Though they were born on Earth, in a temple much like the one we stand in, they have since left this planet to live amongst the stars. There was no peaceful way for they, the Obake, to coexist with humans. Who... who are you? Oh, you were the monk we met! You took us to a shrine to make a prayer! Very good. Your memory is sharp. However, my identity should not concern you. There are more pressing matters for you to attend to. Like... The hungry Obake behind you for a start. Obake? Oh, wow! That's a big monster! Everyone, get ready. We have to take this one down. All right. Jeez. All right. Let's just go ahead and, uh, It's not really an easy way to deal with this, so I'm just going to heal everybody. Okay. Uh, power strength. Hundred. Yuck. Eight. Spirit Mind Air. Iki. Okay. Uh, do, 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 do. Book. Oh. Above, up. Joe. Uh, that one there is stand, Ta. and then that one there is tree. Ki. Got the spell halt and some money. <laughs> An admirable effort. Well done. It would appear the Obake are no match for your knowledge of Japanese. Truly, the Obake have a fundamental weakness. Once their shape is identified and compromised, they wither away. Perhaps, in time, the Obake will learn to cover this glaring flaw. Hey, you. So what exactly is your role in all this? Why did everything turn to dust the moment you arrived in our lives? As I said previously, my identity should not concern you. I am but a humble servant. Is that so? Who do you serve then? You're persistent, aren't you? Even if I phrase it delicately, you would not like the answer. It is best you return to what is left of your home. Leave this place at once. Huh? I don't like the tone of your voice, mister. Fools! Each in 
and every one of you are fools. Ah, well, that's escalated. So be it. You can struggle against fate all you wish. Do what you will. I've no doubt we shall meet again. <sighs> there is no doubt in my mind that he has something to do with the city's disappearing. It tears me up that we can't get him to just spit it out. Elliot, calm down. We'll figure this out one way or another. Fine! I'm gone! Elliot! Yo, man, oh, wait up! <sighs> Don't sweat it, Hana-sensei. You're right. We will figure this out. Don't you agree? Absolutely. Yeah! See? It's not so bad. Thank you, Holly. Thank you, too. I only wish there was more we could do. I suppose for the meantime, we'll head back home. I hope Elliot didn't stray too far. Damn it. Damn that smug attitude of his. It makes me so angry. Elliot, we're all on your side here. Try not to run away like that again, okay? Whatever. What does it even matter if I run? We need you, buddy. We can't do this without you. Look, that monk absolutely is behind all this. For one, the Conti monsters didn't attack him at all. They only targeted us. He wasn't even phased by it. And secondly, every person in town has reported meeting a monk, him, before their city disappeared. Exactly. This guy is totally guilty. I know that, all right. But what good does it do if we can't get answers from him? How are we supposed to restore Japan to normal if he won't confess to what he did? Good question. Um, he did say we'd meet again. Maybe next time we give him a good slapping? <laughs> I can't imagine you slapping anybody, Frederick. Hey, I, I could do it. You know, since he's a bad guy and all. <laughs> Nah, you're too much of a softie, Freddy. You couldn't do it. Yeah. <laughs> um, thanks, guys. I appreciate you coming out to me. No problem, Elliot. Just remember, we're in this together, right? Yeah, we're a team. Yeah, we are. Thank you. All right, and now we're back to this. Don't think I have any new quests to mess around with until I do the next lesson. Um, I have a bunch of money laying around. Of course, I don't really know the use for money besides maybe upping speed and uh, HP. don't really have a don't really have a frame of reference of what would be an actually you know useful upgrade here. Uh, let's try armor. Okay, we're up to leather armor. We get a snow coat. And then of course there's all the rings. What do they have equipped? Scarf, which doesn't really do much. And you have shoe polish. Okay. Honestly, it feels like speed is something that's kind of important. So I can actually, you know, try to outspeed some things. Uh, so we got 
Holly at 27 speed. 32. Alright. Yeah, let's go ahead and swap you for that. So you have 47 speed. Maybe you can actually do something with that. Uh, we have weapons we don't need. So let's buy ourselves one more speed ring. We'll swap that for the scarf. What are you using? Here's a spirit ring. Which, uh, I don't really need that badly, so I'll swap. Like I said, speed seems to be more important overall. And uh, with that, I don't feel like I'm going to have enough time to do a lesson, so I'm going to go ahead and call it here. I am the Depressed Dealer. This was Learn Japanese to Survive Kanji Combat. Sorry for all the struggles with uh, messing up the kanji symbols. It's been it's been a busy few weeks, and uh, my review of kanji has been a little bit slacking lately. Uh, my katakana and stuff has been kind of keeping up a little bit. But uh, yeah, see you guys next time.